Alright, welcome back once again to Rise of the Tomb Raider. So, let me kind of explain. Okay, okay, we're coming, we're coming. So, my recording software actually crashed about five minutes into the last episode, so there's about 40 minutes of gameplay that you're missing here because I can't go back. Thankfully, nothing really plot-heavy happened in the last episode. It was mostly just traversing the terrain and stuff like that. I will say the side mission for the witch, I didn't finish that shit. Uh, when I got back to the main area, I found out I had to do a bunch of other side quest shit to do it, and I was just like, to hell with this, I'm not gonna do it. So I just continued with the main quest. I killed some people, I explored a tomb, I found Jacob, and here we are. So, there you go. 40 minutes saved. But it's safe now. It used to be. All right. Trinity must have found the old mining equipment. Oh, and we ended up in a old uranium mine, and I was concerned about the radio the radiation, but I think we're okay. Not anymore. And we learned how to make Molotov cocktails, and they made me use them a dozen times. Are you kidding me? Literally just just found him and now we're separated like that already oh my goodness see this is the kind of stuff that you want this is how you start an episode yeah I think we're obviously going this way yep holy shit Wow, we lucked out. Yeah, nothing like that happened in the past 40 minutes or so. Pretty dull 40 minutes, if I'm being honest. Landed some really amazing headshots, though, I was really excited about. And I also put my coat back on. My white coat. Alright, what do we got here? We got three people. Now we gotta fix that lift. I know. Just let me try something here. Just gonna make some arrows here right quick. The elevator's jammed. The track looks rusted through. Okay, spread out. Find something to pry it loose. That's a mistake, because I'm gonna murder you all. And I'm gonna show you my new skill that I got last episode. So just wait. This guy gonna come towards me? He is. What a doofus. Buddy, you are already dead. You just don't know it yet. Ah, that's the stuff. Alright, so now he is a trap. Okay. So, we're gonna try and... Ooh. Good shit. I like that. It's very useful. So he set him up, he heard the beeping, and now he's dead too, so. Uh, is there a way that we can get up to that guy, or do we just have to kill him from here? Uh, I assume we can probably make it up to him. I don't know. Let's, let's do this first. You know, there's bad guys in the area, but we're just over here. Oh shit. Okay, we made too much noise there. Buddy, I'm gonna need you to turn around. What the hell? You know, some dead people over there. Is that the issue? Show yourself. <laughs> I forgot again how to fucking. Ah, oh, there we go. Auto attack him. Shit. I forgot how to melee attack there for a moment. I got a little dicey. I didn't realize he had a helmet on. Alright. We're just now learning how to move objects, huh? Alright, let, let go of the object. Thank you. Got to try that control panel. Hello. This should come in handy. 
Ooh. That's gonna be good for murders. I mean, useful for that too, I guess. So in the last episode, well, I'm, I'm gonna call it the last episode because it was going to be, but obviously it's gone now. But in the last episode, they taught me how to make Molotov cocktails and there was a certain obstacle that you couldn't get by without making them. And when they taught me how to make them, they decided to just make me use it 50 times. And it was really, really annoying. Why, how, where am I going here? Cause I can't get up there. What am I doing? Do I need the elevator? Is this the issue? Oh shit. Okay. Oh shit, oh, shit is right. Alright, anyway, so they made me use the Molotov cocktail like a dozen or more times in the last episode and it was really annoying. Climb, can I not climb the rope? Is that not an option? Cut it. Obviously gonna climb this. Oh, we're gonna go climb some ice. Okay, let's go. So I'm thinking that because they just gave me the knife, there's gonna be like a dozen or more situations where they're like, oh, you need the knife here. So fully expect to see that because if I've learned anything so far, it's when they introduce a new mechanic, they overuse the hell out of it. Because they really don't want you to forget about it. So fully expecting to cut another two dozen things. All right, you know the rule, you have to pause to read that stuff. I'm not gonna sit here and hold your hand and read it to you. Let's continue. All right, and I can see traps now. I got a, an ability where I can see traps. They glow in red. No, 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 no. So that's also something that happened the last episode. Which is great because Traps and I don't get along. This mural shows the prophet. My coffee is cold now. I made this coffee before I started the last episode. I didn't finish it because I kind of forget about it. So it's at least an hour that's been sitting on my desk now. I don't care about that Jacob fella. It makes no damn difference to me. Rapidly becoming the story of my life. Yes, indeed it is. To survive, yet strangely, Death from above. That sounds brilliant. Incredible ruins all around me. Check out the weapons. Part of the prophet's lost city. But how much more is true? Semi auto pistol. Could it be really Moon Shadow? Oh my lord. Ooh. Okay, hold on. Um, semi auto pistol or this one? I'm thinking this one, if I'm being completely honest. Rate of fire, stability, reload speed. We're going to go with that for right now. Uh, I do want to go back. Honestly, I'd rather have the sniper rifle than the assault rifle. I haven't found the parts for that. Yeah, I'm gonna go with this, because I'll be able to scope in most like- Oh my god, it's gold? What the hell? Okay, well... Uh, we're gonna go back to this. We can update some more stuff, so we're gonna do a rate of fire I don't care about. Ammo capacity is always nice, and this. There we go. Because I've been using a revolver. I don't want to use the revolver anymore. Let's check it out. It looks weird. I don't know if I'm supposed to have... Yeah, this is strange without a scope. I don't know if I'm even supposed to have some of these weapons. I don't know if they're part of the DLC that I have because of the addition of the game that I bought. Oh no! Smoke grenades. Well, ideally, I don't need these. Like, best case scenario, I'm not gonna need these smoke grenades. Oh! Well, if they're going to use the knife like that, then I'm pretty happy about it because that was awesome. I'm trying to make sure that I don't get spotted here. 
I want to shank this guy. Ah, that feels good. Yeah, I, I like that. All right, well, the knife was worth it. Happy to have it. Let's get all this stuff. You know, you can read that, whatever. Don't care. Do or don't, whatever. Let's take the smoke grenade, which I don't really want to use it. I'd prefer to kill everybody stealth. In a stealth manner, but I, I don't know if it's going to be a possibility. Let's let them talk for a moment, see if they start to separate. I'm wondering if this guy directly in front of me is going to turn around and walk towards me. Doesn't really look like it though, not from what I can tell. Um. Oh, that's not what I want to do. Oh, I gotta craft the smoke grenade first. We're gonna toss it. I love it, they just immediately know where I am. That pisses me off. I hate games that do that. Like, don't just immediately show the enemies where I'm at. Make the AI work for it, damn it. Okay, make them have to run around, figure out where it came from, you know, that kind of stuff. Don't just, don't just immediately give them a radar and be like, oh, over there. Go get them. Upgrade tools, cool. That went pretty well, though. Shot the barrel, threw a Molotov, they burned to death, problem solved, no big deal. Took one bullet and a bottle. So, pretty happy with that. Alright, we got everything here. I believe we do. No, there's sticks right here. Let's get these sticks. Let's go this way. Ooh, more sticks. Bundles of sticks everywhere. What a delight! It is. No, no, no. This thing just stopped working as I got up here, huh? That's super convenient. Ugh, I got to go all the way across. What a nice view, though. It's gonna be like an epic boss-like fight in this thing, I bet. That's my guess, anyway. Okay, here's the thing. No shit. Um... Well, I was just gonna say, I wanna... If you're gonna give me the option to go down that way... I was gonna go down here anyway, but obviously I need to to make this work. So let's go. Oh shit! This is not a good situation. Okay, good. I was like, please. I was holding my breath there for a moment. Is he gonna fall? Push this cart off. Get out the way. Alright, we're gonna go up to here. There we go. Is there anything over here first? Alright, so we're gonna do this. I mean, we're obviously gonna roll it back to us. We're gonna use this fancy new knife that we got. Oh my goodness. And then we're gonna watch it fall. Come on, are you serious right now? Now I am gonna say, from a combat standpoint, I'm really happy with the knife. But just like the Molotov, you know, they're, they're really gonna make me use it a lot, it seems like, which is just mostly annoying. do anything with that let's go over here we're making progress look at those boots all right who's down here i'll shoot you with my rifle i'm just kidding there's somebody down here at least i don't think so there might be but i don't think there is shoot with my ridiculous looking pistol oh shit 
Okay, I was teasing about there being someone here. Okay, I was just teasing. Come on, pick that up, please. Oh, I just, uh, I think I just shanked that guy. Really? That guy did not, uh, are you kidding me? I thought I killed this guy. But apparently he did not die. Alright. We're gonna be okay. Nope! Ah, the recoil! Alright. We're fine. Everything's fine. I need to heal, though. Oh, you... You think you can just toss smokes like that, you big bitch? No, I can toss smokes too, you asshole. Get the f*** out of here. Oh, shit! Oh, you got lit up, sir. I didn't think that actually hit, so I was actually pretty impressed by that. What a good throw. Alright, now I can breathe a little bit. Fuck. Like I said, I was teasing, okay? I was joking about there being people down here. I didn't actually expect there to be a whole crew of people. And using this rifle is obviously a questionable decision in fights like this when a AK would come in handy, but that's fine. I'm just gonna continue doing it anyway. Hmm. Was that there before? I mean, I guess I'm gonna have to go that way anyway. It's not like I have a lot of options here, do I? Is there anything else I'm missing? Can't get this ammo. I can't get those mushrooms. Are all my guns reloaded? Oh shit. I guess that was a bad time to check about guns, but that's fine. We're doing okay. See, this episode's already 110% more exciting than the last one. You don't know that, but trust me, it is. It was definitely a filler kind of episode. So better it be that episode than this one so far. Gold sword hilt inlaid with jewels. This belonged to a Byzantine noble. Hmm. Mm. The blade it snapped off the base. Off. Did this happen in battle? Maybe, maybe not. Who knows? Let's go. Alright. Uh, trap, obviously. Which we will avoid to get this backpack. I will drink some coffee since this animation takes too damn long. Secrets revealed. Punji pit. Watch out. Oh, hello. The rifle's powerful, though. I did like the damage on it. I just... What was that? I'm hearing things. I did like the damage on it. I just, um... I don't know. I just... The reload and stuff kind of sucked, so... Basically the exact same position I was just in. You suck! Oh shit. Can I swap shoulders please? Thank you. Oh shit, I didn't- I couldn't see where my reticle was. So you gonna come left side or right? Come on. Which side are you coming out on? Damn it, I missed. I saw the headshot icon there for a second too. There we go. Lit. I'm really getting tired of you guys. You're starting to piss me off. Like, go away. <laughs> brilliant. Fucking brilliant. Alright, um... Let's go climb this ladder. This poor guy up here didn't stand a chance. Oh, there's a thingamajig there too. A barrel. Where the hell do I get lockpicks from? That's what I need to know. Like, how do I go about getting lockpicks? Where does that stuff come from? I find so many of these chests that I can't get into and I don't know what to do with them. 
If you know what to do with them, leave a comment so I can figure out what the hell to do with them. Because I assume I'm going to run into many more throughout the rest of the game and currently just no clue what to do. Wow. Ballsy move to put yourself in that kind of position, isn't it? Um, which way are we going? Are we going this way? Yep, we're going this way. Uh, uh. Alright, are we going to... Well, I don't think I'm going to run up, so let's go down. Nice. Oh, shit. I was jumping thinking I could grab a hold of that, but apparently that's a no-go. So... Who's here? Who's here? Alright, nobody apparently. Uh, we need to find a way to... What does this do? Currently nothing. Okay, let go of that. We've got to find something to connect it to. If I can bring down that crane, it should be enough to rip open the door. Well, my question is, where do we hook it to? Do we hook it to this? Is that what we're hooking it to? No. We can't pull this, can we? Obviously. Um. Oh, I got it. They taught us how to move stuff. Let's use our brain and move stuff. Alright, that should be close enough. Alright, alright, alright. Alright, let go, let go. That should be good. So we're just gonna grab this. Stick it to that. Come on. Where's the icon? There we go. You know what we gotta do now? Chill! <laughs> oh my lord, what a sneeze. Um, you know exactly what happens next. We're gonna pull this up. We gotta let it go. And up, oh, look at this. Knife mechanic. Coming in hot. Well, that was the anticlimactic as shit, wasn't it? Oh, I, I see what the problem is. I wasn't even paying attention to the water there. We need to pull it back so it fills up with water. Oh shit, what am I doing? Good grief. I forgot to cut the rope. Alright, let's try this one more time. Pull it back. All the way till we get water in it. Is that gonna be like right there? Or do we go back further? Do we leave it like right there? Do you think that's enough water? I don't know. Apparently it wasn't filling up with water at all. Bullshit! Didn't feel like we almost had it at all. Alright. My next thought... Is to pull this back. Let's go! Okay, well we learned something valuable there. Maybe we push it all the way down. So like right there. Right. That should work. I mean, it looked like it was pretty much getting water last time. It's, it's kind of bullshit if you ask me, but that's okay. Try this again. Fifteenth time is a charm. Alright, Laura, tell me when. Oh, yeah, that's visibly different, isn't it? That did it. Let's go. Oh, shit. I thought I was going to have to cut that. I was literally standing right in front of that when that happened. I should have died, honestly. Let's go! No, we gotta, we gotta sprint, girl. We gotta sprint. We ain't got time for this shit. We gotta sprint! My lord, what a shit show this is. Oh, Jesus! Well, that's convenient. Shit's getting crazy. I can't handle it. My heart just can't do it. Just can't do it.
And this. It shows the exodus of his people from the deserts of Syria. Hmm. They settled in a hidden valley and built a great city. Katash. To protect the city and its people, the Prophet raised an army of warriors. But what is this showing? The devil. It's I don't know. The divine source they're holding. Something else. Something else. But what? Oh, so I came up with a theory in the last episode that her father isn't dead and he's behind it all. Might always know his city and its secrets. I have no actual information on why I feel that way, but it could show the way to the divine source. Like I said, there was zero plot development last time, so this is the this is the best we've had uh, in the last 40 minutes or so. Or hour, really. <clears throat> Alright, so we're gonna try and find a fireplace, and I think I'm probably gonna cut this episode here. Uh, let's, let's actually check out this area first before I do. Because we made some good progress. It's a pretty intense little episode that we've got going on here. Uh, where the hell am I going? What am I missing here? Where am I supposed to go? Over there. All right, hold on. Let it, let me take a moment and figure out. Oh, we've it's got some steps down here. This this temple has traps in it. What the hell is that? Bunch of assholes. Absolutely hate underwater s stuff, but it's fine. We made it. I have to do it again. This bullshit. Because I don't want to do it. Yeah, I know. We're almost dead. Okay, we made it. We're fine. Heal up. It's fine. Uh, we made it to this geothermal valley. Which is pretty cool. Is there going to be a fireplace up here? I'm thinking there's got to be one around here soon. I don't know. Let's just go ahead and get to the objective area here. See what the deal is. Boss fight. It's the witch again. Well, fuck me. Stop right there. Easy. Sophia, you Easy. bitch. You know I'm not with Trinity. Why should we believe you? Oh yeah, I forgot. She's I good or something. A man named Jacob. Where is he now? He's dead. We were together, but we got separated. I in the killed him. She killed him. No. <laughs> that guy knows what's up. Trust an outsider. Please, listen. I am not your enemy. I warned you. You should have left. Sophia. Enough. Father. Oh. Plot twist. I thought I lost you. I'm glad you made it out of there. Oh, give Sophia, she is cautious. In her position, I'd be the same way. What did you find out? Trinity is coming in force. We must prepare. Her? Kill her. She's a friend. Oh. On my word, no harm will come to her. These ruins. We must be near the Prophet's lost city. Come. We do not have much time. Prepare the weapon stores. Secure the battlements. Go now. They're almost here, but we're outnumbered. The children and elders are vulnerable. Go. Get them into the catacombs. Light the fires. The valley must be alert. Incredible. 
Wow. Sophia, muster our fighters. Then meet me in the upper village. Don't disappear again, father. He looks a little too young to be her father to me. I don't know. Or maybe she's a little... I, I don't know. Just seems weird. For now, I'll do what I can to help. I'm gonna end up being a one-person army. I'm just gonna murder everybody. Alright, I see a fireplace down here, so we're gonna go down there. And I'm going to save it and call it quits here so let me know what you thought about this episode feel free to like comment all that good stuff uh i'll catch you guys in the next one